Hey everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel, W3 Army. Today I'm going to show you a payment form. Payment form will be first I would like to I will make a step that is for personal information and once the step will clear then it will redirect the next step with the product. Working with product basically like if you have one single product and you want to make make money online from e-commerce like website or your client uh, need a website and he has a, just single one or two product like he has uh, just a headphone or like two or three t-shirt he want to make uh, he want to sell this product using wordpress but he don't want to use uh, like big plugin uh, such as uh, woocommerce it was a big plugin so here you can make here you can install a plugin that is gravity form using gravity form you can make a lot more thing so today i'm going to share with you how to make a pay, payment form so in order to do this you just go to form first of all you have to make sure that is you have to install the elementor plugin also if you design the gravity form you have to install the essential add-on if you if you wanted to design today i'm, do, I'm not gonna to show you design the last part uh, last part will be i want to sh i would like to show you how to design all those form just i want to show you the how to make a form how to make a payment form like functionality system i would like to show you right now so first of all you, you will go the forms and go to form and today is the third one uh, third one is uh, that is the name will be payment form payment oh, sorry 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 payment form okay all right create form today i will show you a new field that is page actually as far as i know uh page is the new one uh previous video i didn't show uh, how it's work that page uh, field and uh, today i'll show you the page uh, in the first start in the, as you can see start paging just click the start paging here and you will see this kind of uh, bar the right side uh, he, what kind of or uh, design you want like progression indication or step indication or none I just want to uh, I just want to show I just want to add a step okay and first step will contact information and second step this one second step will be uh, product or payment like something uh, we are the city product the first starting page you will add the single line text here will be I want to grab his name and we'll add email. Email, as an EM email. Drag and drop it over here. Okay, done. The first save will be this one. Once you click this uh, next, and it will redirect the it will redirect to the step page, the second page that is uh, payment step payment form now i will add the product form product field product field uh, under the product field you just scroll the uh, right side bar and you will see product okay you just drag and drop it over here okay this one is a product and if you want to add option like if you have another uh, product like if uh, you, you just have a polo t-shirt and you, you have you have some size like medium large extra large and you can do this just by this field just drag it drop, drop it over here and option will be the product name uh, first of all you have to uh, type your product uh, name product name your polo t-shirt polo t-shirt and option will be here here has a three type of field you just select uh, the drop down if you want and if you want to check box if you want a ready option ready option you just click just single 
uh, option if you uh, select the checkbox checkbox your, your visitor can select two items if they want and drop down drop down when they click the icon just it will down under the box okay and i would like to add um, radio button okay if you want to add description you can type over here okay and the last one is choice choice is the most important thing that is polo t-shirt large medium small the first one will be media uh, small and second one will be medium and third one will be large done the uh, small uh, small size will be like 12 12 dollar and medium dollar medium will be 18 dollar and large will be 25 that's i just uh, put the random number okay and if you want to show value your visitor will see your uh, their in this product size price on the right side of this item okay so first one uh, although this is the 12 dollar and i would like to copy and paste over here copy and paste over here also copy and paste over here done and if you want to see total field okay you just click the add field and go to the uh, and scroll down and you will see the total of uh, the field of this uh, field like total field and just drag and drop it over uh, over here or you don't want to do this anything over here just save from and preview as you can see this is a fully static form i don't do any design i already told you in the last video will be design part and i just share with you just a functionality of this form okay the i uh, also i told you this one will be the multi step form and this is the step step will be i just uh, show you, I, I just tell you and here if you, if you click the start point in here and you will see the step or progress bar if you, uh, then we just click the step bar and it will show the step the first step and second step and if you select the progress bar and you will see the, uh, how progress bar uh, see look like like uh, if you search on the google the progress bar progress bar you will see this kind of progress bar over here this kind of uh, this kind of progress bar and this kind this kind like this kind of progress bar over here okay the, although i just select the step that will that uh, here the show uh, the step option okay first name was test and email will be test at the red gmail.com done next click the next once you click the next button and you will see the polo t-shirt is the quantity option and this is the this is the uh, polo t-shirt size and uh, here is the total of this uh, product or product price if you select the medium option okay medium and quantity will be one the medium was uh, medium price was if we see the medium price as you can see the medium price is the um, 18 if you uh, increase the number of this quantity just 36 also 54 and if you change the uh, size and the, uh, if you if the quantity is three and it will uh, okay if I, if, if, I, if I decrease the number it, it doesn't change anything uh, if I uh, refresh the form sometime it will it not work okay I just select the large amount and quantity will be 18 okay 36 okay right now it's worked uh, so this is the um, work, uh, this is the payment form you just click the submit button and it will uh, send a thanks to you and how you get the information from your visitor you just click the entries just leave it over here and in the, you just click the entries and select the form the fear form is right now payment form this is the payment form right now i have uh put i have complete the form this is the previous one i, I just i just trash the uh, form and if you want to see the uh, full information just click the view option 
and you will see how many product your visitor wants he just want a polo t-shirt 80 dollar quantity 2 and total limit is 36 okay so now i will add a payment method once the click the submit button and he will redirect to the paypal okay here you have to install the paypal plugin so this is the paypal plugin i have already uh, installed just activate plugin if you want this plugin you just contact with me or you can go to my uh, website the website is webterminal.com the webterminal.com here you will see some uh, important plugin and if you don't have this kind of plugin you just contact me i will um, i will uh, give you this plugin and uh, our all plugin was a very less price as you can see our price uh, every plugin our theme is very very less price if you wanna this kind of plugin you can download it for five dollar and the most important stuff is you can use this kind of plugin for your client don't worry about it so although if your client don't have uh, a big budget for uh, buy a plugin you can buy plugin from this website all right just I have already installed the plugin and you have to go to the form option again and go to the uh, payment form just click the edit button and now you have to go to settings and you will see the new option of this form uh, of this settings the option is paypal just click the paypal and create the new uh, config start the paypal settings just click the setting option take the sub and save also you have to go again paypal i'm sorry you have to return the page and get add okay here is the paypal name if you want to change the name you can right now this is the most important thing is email in this email your all payment will be uh, will uh, In this email your all payment will go this mail and if you enter the email email will be i just send a random email test at the rate um gmail.com all right this is this will be gmail and you have to select the type of your transaction the transaction only product and service and it will appear a new field sum i just wanna uh, I just want the uh, customer name also email okay just select this one uh, these two field and save all right just go to the paypal okay now i would like to enter the form the form name is ghost Sorry, Jost. Jost at rate gmail.com. All right, the next, uh, the polo t shirt I would like to uh, add. I would like to click the small one and product quantity will be two. Then submit. And right now it will appear the PayPal. Okay right now paypal is not working in here in, in our country that's why it's sometimes it uh, appear the wrong message but you can uh, when you click uh, when you add the paypal and you will see uh, this kind of in interface that is login information and if you enter the uh, email and password and it will uh, cut your uh, from your balance okay so today's video is um, done so I hope you and you can enjoy all the video. Thank you. Thank you very much.